extra special warning. Our hosts do no research and preparation for these movies. They are just two cynical douchebags. They think just because they have ten years of bad TV under their belts, they are qualified to review these horrible movies. Hey everybody, Burton Gutter here. We're here with another one of the worst movies on Netflix. And this week, to reset from the crap Netflix Halitober we have had, yeah. we decided we were going to do a sequel to the very first movie we have ever fucking reviewed, which was Two-Headed Shark Attack. Yeah. And obviously this is Three-Headed three shark. shark Attack, yeah. But no Brooke Hogan. Thank fucking God. They replaced No them. Charlie O'Connell no and no Charlie fucking O'Connell Carmen O'Connell. Electra. No. They replaced them with even worse people. <laughs> yeah, but what anyway, right? So we, we just thought we're doing this, and we're like, oh, it's TV-14, so Yeah, you're not going to get much of anything. Yes, but whatever, right? Weren't so, we wrong? Well, we'll get into that, because it starts off saying, you know, Sci-Fi Presents, obviously, and then, of course, the second title we get is The Asylum fucking of Presents. Course, and you're like, oh, yeah. But no, but it's been an extremely long time since we yes, watched the Asylum movie, so, like, we kind of didn't hate this as much as no, we fucking... No, I was actually enjoying this, you know, because in a way, I mean, one of my favorite people. But it was a lot of fucking stupidity, and a lot of us yelling at the screen, like, what the fuck? Well, but, yeah, well, because there was no scientific facts. At all. Well, at all. Yeah, but during the opening credits, we get to learn that this has fucking Jenna Sims Jenna in it. Sims, dude. From 50 Foot, Attack of the 50 Foot Cheerleader. Yeah, man. Has fucking Rob Van Dam in it. Rob Van Dam. All oh, looking Danny stoned fucking, the whole damn time. Danny Trejo. Oh, boy. Danny's. Yeah. And directed by Christopher Olin Ray, so. Yeah. 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 That's just a whole big group of. The bastard child of Fred Olin Ray. Keeps making How do you know he's a bastard? <laughs> I don't know, but he keeps making shit shit movies, you know? He can't be Fred Ola Ray's real son. I, I, I do not believe. It. Anyway. <laughs> He's been adopted. He doesn't have Fred The actual talent. movie itself starts with these fucking people partying on the fucking beach. Why not? That's how they always start. And then it goes inside like this cabin or whatever, and there's people fucking. And I'm like, well, TV 14. Yeah, we're just going to get a little well, side Because our arms are like this, covering up everything, yeah. and they were real close. But then all of a sudden, blah, Ooh, titties. She just we're like, whoa, whoa, whoa. Oh, my God, this is a children's movie. I thought this was TV 14. I guess fucking not. Apparently not. Well, unless they're allowed to show titties now and that kind of thing. I know. Times are changing. But anyway, so it cuts back outside, and then we get to see this cat face collagen injected bolted on fucking too much eyeballs. makeup fucking bitch her fucking, fucking face was caked in makeup. Her eyes were caked in makeup. Man, yeah, just I don't even awful. know if she even opened up her fucking eyes. But this dude's all like, hey, we need to go skinny dipping, blah, blah, blah. Oh, skinny dude. Yeah, and he was like, check out my physique. So he jumps into the fucking water. Naked. You know, swims out to this buoy. She just gets in the water. Sort of into the water. Yeah. yeah. And then goes underwater a little bit, but doesn't want to get her fucking cat face wet. So she stands <laughs> back up, plops out her fucking It'll bolted mess with arms. The injections, I guess. Yeah. yeah. You know? Plops out the bolted arms and then... <laughs> bolted on. I told Jamie that. She was like, what the fuck does that mean? I'm like, bolted on. They're just like... Grr, grr. You know what I mean? Like, they're not, not, they don't look real at all. You know? Yeah. And they're not attractive. They're just like balloons. They're like, bolt. They don't jiggle. They don't squish nothing. They're just... There. So anyway, as dude's swimming to the fucking buoy, he's being followed by a three-headed great white fucking shark. Yeah. That from this angle and time is pretty fucking huge. Yeah. Right? A little bit 50 feet. Then it goes yeah. to 13 feet. But we'll, sometimes we'll get into seven. that at other times, then too. 15 inches. But whatever, right? So the people notice it. So this one other dude jumps in the water, but, you know, then the chick, bolted on chick, gets fucking oh, got. she's got by that point. Yeah. yeah. He was like, oh, man, I could have had sex with her fucking plastic but parts. Whatever. Right, so dudes hang on to the buoy. The fucking three headed shark comes out of the fucking water like a thousand onto feet. the beach. Oh, no, wait, oh, onto the fucking one, yeah. beach and eats three separate people. Oh, yeah, like it beached itself. You yeah, know? and but but it don't matter because this thing can do anything, it could drive a car if it wanted to. <laughs> Almost, yeah, it could. It, it, it has no limits. No, none. Don't. There are no I mean, fucking limits to, of reality to this even fucking thing. No, there was like a billion times where these people could have fucking just like got away from it. You know what I mean? Like, go to Idaho. It's not gonna follow you. You know what I mean? But it could have. It could have. This shark had to, like, it could have flew a plane. Yeah. This shark could have literally... Could have came to your door and been like, handygram. <laughs> <laughs> but 
anyway, right? So from that we get the opening title, and then from that we get fucking Jenna Sims in the in a wetsuit coming out of the water. Yeah. She goes into this research facility that researches the ocean. Something, and shit, yeah, whatever. whatever. We don't and then she strips out of her fucking Woo! wetsuit, we get to see her fucking yeah, face eyes. I, I hope she did that for us. I, I, I seriously mean, doubt it. She did it for the paycheck. Had nothing to do with us. Just because we mentioned her lopsided, bolted on <laughs> fucking fish eye titties doesn't mean she did it for us. And she commented back about us <laughs> fucking saying it. Yeah, she did do it for us. <laughs> I wish she would have. But anyway, she gets paid uh, to the office for some fucking reason because she's a doctor. She's oh, doctor, oh, professor, yeah. scientist, Jenison. Yeah, she's doctor, professor, scientist, hot as balls, Jenison. Which is slightly, slightly better than Dr. Professor Brooke Hogan from Sand Sharks. But I think she has, like, a lazy eye. I hope she... I don't know if you do or not. But, no, it always looks like she has, like, a lazy eye. Dude, her fucking nipples go this way and that way. Oh, it's so does her eye. And her fucking... <laughs> <laughs> no, they, they're not. It's not, like, obvious. Anyway! It's like, one's way over here, you know, the other one's pointing this way. It's not that bad. It's just one looks like it droops down a little. I don't know! So, anyway, we learn that they have these... <laughs> Like visitors coming to the research center, which is, I forgot to mention, an underwater research center oh, yeah, that is in the middle of huge. the garbage patch. You know, right. like that big fucking thing of plastic out in the ocean that we have caused. Yes. You know. And keep causing to. Yeah. Well, but whatever, right? We're fucking sloths. So these visitors come in and they're just like a whole bunch of 20 something fucking douches. There's, Basically. you know, just multiple douches of every race, color, and sex that you can imagine. Oh, yeah, well, dude, my favorite was Pufferfish Face. That fucking douchebag with oh, the eyes that, that was a scientist guy, wasn't no, it? No, he's a was douchebag kid. Which the one, one that was banging the, 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 the Asian chick. I don't know. The one who couldn't put any word. Oh, the one that looked like the bizarro Baba Booey. Yeah, he looked like Baba Booey, but <laughs> Baba Pussy. But, like, you know, he had fucking, you know, his, his eyes were literally on the side of his head. And he had big dangly you. teeth. Oh, dude, it. his teeth were huge. He could not close his mouth. That's he had, he had danglier teeth than the three-headed shark did. For real, dude. Like, I would literally tell the dentist, file my shit down. But what? Whatever. It doesn't fucking matter. We get a whole bunch of exposition, dialogue, blah, blah, fucking blah. Yeah. Who fucking cares? Yeah, nobody gives a rat's fucking ass. Like, look, look, there were no facts. No. No science facts. Like, oh, the shark, for some reason, starts attacking the facility, right? Yeah, for whatever reason. And this dude's sitting on the toilet taking a poop. And then the floor tiles start moving a little well, bit. Well, it did break through at one point because that giant basement that was a space... I don't know, a fucking oceanic center, whatever you want to call it. But it was literally a fucking basement, you know, or or where. Okay, yeah, that's fine. Whatever, but, but like it broke through there. But right? no alarms went off, no, no fucking water surged in, nothing. Well, that the little guy was like, "Oh my god, everything's flooding," and he's standing there, and there's nothing going on. But anyway, like I say, dude was sitting <laughs> on the toilet taking a fucking poop, right? The fucking floor tiles start lifting a little bit, and then the three-headed shark, which was like a hundred feet long earlier in the movie is now like six feet wide like six feet long yeah so he comes out of the ground he goes rock and fucking <laughs> gets the dude the guy didn't even get a chance to wipe or anything that's, nope. that's embarrassing taking a poop oh, yeah, shark I, gets you. also did forget to mention that the visitors and and fucking the other scientist guy they go down into this part of the center where they're researching the effects of pollution on animals right where they're just polluting water and throwing animals in <laughs> <laughs> basically so they have all these little mutant creatures in these tanks right meanwhile Jenna Sims has this tight as balls white just a white t-shirt like a yeah. like a bum t-shirt like when you get on Sundays and put it on not when you're in your facility center showing people around and stuff. She's got these abnormally sized glasses on because remember she's supposed to be smart. Yeah. You know, but in a moment's notice you could be like wah 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 wah. He's yeah. sexy. Sort of. But anyway. <laughs> Right, so we cut outside, and there's one of the visitors never went inside, so he's just hanging out there, and he sees what he says is a whale, so he oh, yeah. goes into the he's fucking in water. He's in water, by the way. Yeah, he's in water that's, like, this deep. Yeah, ankle deep. It was, like, ankle deep water. So he's yeah. out in the fucking water. Jenna and, like, the other visitors come up, and they're no. like, what are you doing? Oh, get the no. fuck out of here. You're putting way too much into it. Why don't you do it how they really did it? No. There's a shark in the water. Stop. But anyway, right, so he's in the water, no. and the three-headed fucking 
rocket start, which is now a hundred feet long of fucking game. Oh yes. Jumps of out of a the ankle deep water. Near. Jumps all the way up in the fucking it does air. The triple Lindy twist and comes turn. back down and takes out dude and lands in the ankle deep water. Diving motion <laughs> in the water. It didn't go. Pfft. And then just flop yeah. over. It went in. Okay. <laughs> yeah. Again, no scientific fact at all. Like, you know what I mean? Like, they did, they're like, oh, wait a minute. That guy was standing in an inch of water, but it dove down. Fuck it. Move on. So the fucking people in the research facility are trying to call out, but they can't because of the radiation of the garbage Yes, because packs. they got one radio in this giant facility. Yeah. No cell phones. No nothing. They got one guy with a bunch yeah. of TV monitors, you know. Know, like that everybody had to bring from home because yeah. the asylum's too cheap to pay for it, probably. But anyway, right? So we cut back to the room where the mutant yeah. specimens were. Oh, yeah. All the aquariums and stuff are knocked over, and there's a dude laying on the ground with, with, like, his, pie with his face, face eating. Yeah. Okay, so I'm like, did the mutant things do this? Are we going to ever see them again? No. No. They never bring no. them up. Ah, uh, fucking again. Sorry. Because obviously the shark didn't get into the facility, eat the dude's face, and then get back out without fucking water coming in. Yeah. Lots of unexplained shit. Well, man. like, one thing is, like, <laughs> they get out of the fucking facility, the facility blows up. Somehow. And then supposedly the island's starting to sink. Right. So there's a boat out there, so some of them decide to swim out to said fucking it's boat. It's the only way. Really? You're on an island. Island. You're on an island. You don't need to go into the water. It's unnecessary. Some of them do jump into the water and they start to swim. And then fucking Jenna jumps in and is like, I'm going to distract the fucking shark. Blah, blah, fucking blah. She, she swims out slow as fuck while the shark is really following her as slow as fuck. But the fucking fin is right behind her. Like on top of her, basically. Yeah. It would be literally on her back. And then like 40 yeah. minutes in, Jenna Sims gets eaten and I we're kind of fucking pissed. disappointed. I was pissed. I did not want to see her go. I, I would rather them take that fucking Australian scientist douche was with her the whole time with his fucking puffed out jaw. Yeah. You know what I mean? Why not take him? He contributed nothing. He just kind of sat there and looked creepy the whole time, and then he kept saying, I'll go with you, but do nothing to, <laughs> yeah. to help the cause. So whatever, they take off on the fucking <coughs> boat, right? And they use the radio to call what they think is a Coast Guard, but it's a fishing boat fucking captained by fucking Danny Trejo. Yeah, Danny Trejo with his roadmap of pain face, and they're just, I don't know if they're fishing or whatever. Yeah, they're just, fishing, because he says you reach the, we'll get into that, that you reach the fishing boat, blah, blah, blah. So whatever, the boat that the kids are on are fucking, is driving out, and they're like, oh no, the three-headed shark is going after that party boat paddle boat thing. <laughs> Where there's all these kids on there dancing to fucking generic reggae oh, loops. It was like, but that, but that, the but that, the but that, the but that. They did that for like an hour, and you were like, oh my god. So they finally convinced Danny Trejo that they're not fucking around about a three headed shark, and he's like, fine, I'm on my way. Well, yeah, because he kept fucking around with the Kmart Seth Rogen. He was like, I'm serious, man. You three headed shark jack. And he was going, you're kidding, you know, whatever. And then finally, he was, you know, if I was that dude, I'd be like, look, Fucker, I'm not going to sit here and argue with you whether or whether or not there is a goddamn shark attack. I was like, but there is, and we need help, so stop fucking me around and come on. So anyway, while the shark is swimming around by the party boat, it's just eating cans and bottles. Because Anything, really. it eats this thing, cans and bottles. This thing, it, dude, it eats metal. Like, it's able to eat yeah. metal. It's able to do whatever. It can do arts and crafts. This fucking thing... <laughs> He's fucking a genius. So the yeah. shark lightly bumps the paddle boat and it starts going down. Oh, yeah. Because they say it is, but it ain't fucking this moving. It's 70 just there. ton fucking ship thing, you know, paddle boat, uh, is hit by this 13 foot maybe? Sometimes 100 shark? foot. Sometimes 15 inches. Sometimes, shark? yeah. You know, <laughs> and, uh, and, and it hits it and then everybody's like, ah! And they do the Star Trek thing exactly. where they, they just, everybody, like, everybody they just shake the camera through. and everybody yeah, goes, oh, They did oh. that a couple of times in there, you know. They yeah. everybody like, kind of move around and shit. But, um, yeah, but, uh, yeah, that's not going to happen. It would have been a, a small ding, and everybody like, yeah. oh, what was that? Oh, nothing. But whatever, the shark bumps the boat again, and people start flying off. J trampoline flying, flying off, they were yeah. like, 
<laughs> so the Kmart Jennifer Love Hewitt, which was on this party boat with her fucking geeky ass boyfriend, almost right. falls off. He can't pull her up. So who comes to save her? Fucking Rob Van Dam, RVD, RVD. Oh, comes running got... over and fucking Drunk. grabs her and picks her the fuck up. Looking horrible, you know. He looks like he's just fucking ready to go. <laughs> so, so the crew's kind of freaking out. There's three members of the crew, so imagine what's going to happen, right? But they run like, out yeah. on deck. When I say the deck's maybe 10 foot long, and remember our shark at points is 100 feet yeah. long. Dude, but dude, you didn't mention the fact that when RVD picked her out of the water, out of the water, but picked her up and everything and saved her, you know, what nerd couldn't do, yeah. you know, he was all like, dude... He was up in her shit. RVD <laughs> was like, in my contract, I want to make it so I get Kmart Jennifer Love you and Nerd die. I try to protect him, but I go, oh. And then I get the rub on her titty balls, and then later on the movie, finger her vagina while picking her on boat. <laughs> They're like, whatever, Rob. Anyway. And I want lots of marijuana. Anyway, the three crew members go out onto this fucking little deck. The fucking hundred foot shark jumps oh, yeah. out of the water goes onto the boat, eats all three of them, and then he's just not on the boat anymore. He's just in the water again. Yeah. Like, he just literally rose off like a fucking, <laughs> oh, you know, oh. an F-22 was like, <laughs> and then went over the water and then dived back in. This shark has no limits. Yeah. It none, can do it. Dude, it can, it can fool you. You could be in a restaurant and stuff and, like, get, like, a personal ad and stuff. He's like, meet me here. I want to be friends. And, like, you go there and he's all dressed in a suit and he rips it off. It's the fucking three-headed <laughs> shark. Yeah. He's ah! <laughs> and get you. You know what I mean? And like this shark can do anything. So anyway, right? So we go back to on the party boat. It's going down. Oh yeah, still. Oh, yeah. For like this thing and lasts we get, longer than the Titanic. We, we get more fucking shots of R V D looking and acting like fucking crap. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> He is one step away from rehab in this movie. He's just like... <laughs> and so anyway... He looks like a dumb dog the whole time. He's just like... Oh. Danny Trejo is still on the way. He's still driving the boat from wherever he was to <laughs> this Dude, party boat. Thank you, Jesus Christ. Christ, put it in fucking full throttle, yeah. you know what I mean? Like, we'll get there in four hours. So as the mild chaos We're is going on away. on the party boat, the shark yeah. jumps onto the fucking boat again. again. Yeah. You know, so it jumps on the fucking boat, and the boat starts tipping this way, right? Right. But then it cuts to a shot of, like, the main characters Are on the front of the boat, and whatever. the boat's this way, and the shark's down here, and we the get, like, a face wind this way. Scene. A one point, but yeah, none of the angles match up this Quint like scene. Yeah, because the fucking other, the remaining professor, he fucking falls into the mouth of the fucking. Oh, you shark. mean do nothing? Fucking yeah. no, I'm not interesting. Should have died instead of Jenna Sims. Yeah, fucking professor. Yeah, yeah. Fuck you. You have the audacity to have Jenna Sims pour titties out. For you, you know what I mean? And put her shit back on all slow so, and stuff just so you can kill her off and keep no-nothing douchebag yeah. fucking scientist cock. Yeah. So whatever, it doesn't fucking matter. The shark is eating like Matters 20 eating, people man. by this fucking point and it's still not fucking full yet, plus garbage, plus parts of the fucking research facility. Yeah. It's eating everything. And this thing's going to have some really bad diarrhea. So there's a whole bunch of dead and dying people on the fucking deck of the boat just laying there wounded for some fucking reason. I'm not really sure how. Yeah. I mean, were maybe from the shark banging up and down on the fucking thing and they were just flopping everywhere. So stuff. the remaining characters decide we're getting off this party boat and we're you getting know, back onto jump, our little boat. In order to fall up and over the railing as far as they did, that, that shark had to have gone down 100 feet yeah. and came up and hit it with the force of a submarine. That's the only yeah. way. But anyway, like I said, all the main characters get back on the boat except for the one no fucking Kmart folks. Seth Rogen guy. He's like, don't worry. I'll oh, yeah. catch up. Oh, here he goes. So they take off, and then in slow motion, with an axe, came our Seth his Rogen. Best impression is of running McCormick. up this fucking ramp and <laughs> tries to pull a rain of fire, you know, fucking <laughs> jump up. <laughs> Comes down and axes the shark in the back and is now riding the shark. And looks like sometimes either peeing on it or raping yeah. it. But whatever, the shark jumps up, flips him off, and eats him. Go. 
Yeah, it, it was, that was a quick motion, too. He came yeah. up, flipped around, got him off, and then bit him, and then went back. It was good. That was a nice That was a nice move by three-headed shark puss. So, okay. Shark to puss. This is where I start getting <laughs> angry at the screen. Uh-oh, here we go. Okay, so they're like, the only way out of this is we need to reach this island. No. Okay. Oh. So the island is out there somewhere, but on this side, you can see land. There's an island. On this side, There's an island. you can see fucking land. <laughs> How come they only got to get to this one island? Whatever. I'm not that looks really. smaller than yeah. the two pieces of land beside them. So Danny is still driving there. Yeah, he's taking his good old time, ain't he? Yeah. And then all of a sudden, one of his henchmen goons, who never have any lines, and I'll get into that whenever we talk about that one part that's killer. But yeah, they all of a sudden, they take the seed cover off the one thing, and there's fucking guns. And yeah. all kinds of guns. They're now almost there, Danny right. says. Right. So yeah, they pull out these two fucking assault rifles. Yes, there's Danny no gear, no beer. still driving the fucking boat, because Danny Trejo basically got paid for 90% of this movie to fucking... Drive a boat. And say, say some, some stupid lines. lines. Yeah. <laughs> and look like a roadmap. So apparently. whatever. They get there, and Danny orders his two fucking goons, whatever the yeah. fuck they are, to fucking shoot the fucking shark. Yeah, so you they don't fucking have to shoot, shoot anything. You don't have to do nothing. Yeah, so they shoot the fucking shark, but it does fucking nothing. Nope. The shark jumps up and but kills the two fucking that. goons. Like, he's yeah. driving in the boat back here. He can't see what's going on, and he's like, fire! They fire! Stop firing! And he doesn't question why. He doesn't say, hey, did you get him? No, they're just sitting like this. All of them are just like... And then the shark comes <laughs> up and eats them too, right? Yeah. So it's on the front of the fucking boat. I, I love how I was able to... And he pulls... a fucking giant boat, but he couldn't flip the little... pulls one. out a fucking pistol, shoots a hundred fucking times from without reloading. No, not really. That was a Rambo-like yeah. clip right there, man. And then he finally runs out of ammo, and pulls pull out up? a fucking yeah. machete. Of course, he could use that name. He fucking takes the machete and fucking chops... Chop, chop, chop. ...off the fucking middle head of the fucking shark. He did. He yeah, we think. drives the fucking boat up to with, land. With the shark in the front of it. All dumps crap, the shark like. over. He gets <laughs> out of the fucking water. Starts fucking talking and they Sam Jackson him. Basically. Sam, Sam Jackson him. Yeah, from Deep Blue Sea. Yeah, I know what you mean. You know, so the shark rah, eats Danny Trejo. <laughs> like, oh, and then oh. you're like, oh, well, we're left with Rob VD. Yeah. Great. He probably, so anyway. He probably got VD from some of the extra shit. So RVD and like the whoever else is remaining, Kmart Baba Booey and some <laughs> other people, Kmart right? Baba Pussy. So they run inland, way inland, and they see all these dead people. And then they see the dude that fucking swam out to the buoy in the beginning. And he's like, is he gone? Is he gone? And yeah, they're like... Know, Kmart Baba Booey had the same skill set as fucking uh, Danny Trejo. It's, uh, you know what I mean? Like he never did anything on his own. He kept yeah. telling everybody else that he's like, He's like, like that one chick, he was like, come on, get on the boat, you know? And he's like, hey, go start the boat. Hey, go do this. Hey, go. And I go, hey, puffer fish face. Why don't you fucking do something? You know, like save Jenna Sims, you fucking dick. But anyway, at this point, we learn that the shark can go anywhere on land. <sighs> <laughs> but it can't stay out of water long, they keep saying. But it can get a fucking mile inland if it fucking wants to. Yeah, it could. You know, it can, dude, it can do anything. It could run a seven. Well, but you know what else it can do? Out of its missing middle head hole, oh. it grows three separate, like, or four? I'm not no, sure. it was three what separate fucking little fucking <laughs> mutated heads. <laughs> so now it is a five-headed fucking shark attack. And why and how? It's just like, it's that polluted that it can just grow heads and shit? So what's the point? You couldn't kill it. It yeah. can just grow itself back. Ugh. They decide since they can't stay on that island for some reason, they get onto these two separate boats. RVD oh. and who... Yeah, ever. why did they have to keep getting back to the boats? We're on a, a fucking iron! So whatever, like I said, they're on two separate boats. RVD's on one boat with other people, and other people are on another boat with other fucking people. I don't fucking care. <laughs> they were all the people that really gave a shit. So they go out a little bit, and the five-headed shark ends uh -oh. up taking out the boat that's not RVD's. Like, jumping all up in the air again and blowing it up. I don't know up. how they were, like, like, this far apart, but then in another scene, they're this far apart. Yeah. She's got... Dad! And I was like, hmm? <laughs> He's like, you can't, you, how could you not hear her? So the Asian chick, she ha comes up with a plan, right? They're going to lure the shark with police. Right. 
back to the garbage patch, right? Which will make it which eat it, where itself it was already to death. At before. Yeah, but why would it eat itself to death now and just keep eating, eating, eating until why it dies? It why did it do it before when it was in the garbage patch the whole entire fucking movie? Remember, no scientific facts at all. Why? How could it dive in three inch of water? You know, how so, can it dump up on a, on a boat? How can it flip a 70 ton boat, but cannot flip a fucking little tiny one? Yeah. Duh. So they, Blah. to do the plan, RVD goes on the back of the boat and starts chucking garbage off the back of the boat. The shark jumps up and bites off his arm, and there is a crap geyser of fucking CG blood flying out. That much blood come out, he'd be dead. The chick comes up, minutes. grabs a fucking towel, covers up his fucking stump, and he's like, I'm gonna <laughs> die anyway. So I'm going to sacrifice myself by diving weirdly onto the water slide that's on the back of the boat, <laughs> yeah. tumbling down and landing in the water well, and starting the water to swim slide off. Itself look kind of dry. It would suck on down there. Yeah. Ow! Fuck. So the one other dude's like, no! He jumps in the water and goes after fucking RVD. Oh, finally decided RVD. to do something for himself. Yeah. Instead of making some, I'm surprised he wasn't like, hey, Allison, get in the water and get that dude. Fuck you sitting there for Well, Allison's dead by now. Oh, yeah, I know. But like, she was on the other yeah, boat. He said his, her name like a billion yeah. times. You know? But whatever. So we get RVD swimming in slow motion for fucking ever. Ever. And then he gets fucking God. I don't fucking care. Blah, blah, blah. Yeah, we were. I look, everybody in this movie got God basically. I didn't care. So whatever, right? They get the shark to the garbage patch. It just eats itself to fucking death until blood just starts splurting out of it. Yeah. And then we get fucking Kmart Baba Pussy and the fucking Asian chick sitting on this boat with the fucking sunset and a helicopter coming in happily ever fucking after. Yeah. End of fucking movie. Credits. Suck my fucking left testicle. Asylum. <laughs> I mean, it was fun fucking yelling at the screen and stuff uh, as yeah, we're well, watching like, it, but uh, you're watching as I like, have to relive it again, uh, mm -hmm. yeah. And they killed Jenna Samson. Yeah. Should have kept her for the long run. Yeah. She, she should have been the one survivor. Fucking A. I mean, she acted stiffly throughout the whole movie, but she was still better than the Asian chick exactly. that survived. Exactly. Fuck it. Yeah. Mm -hmm. I'm done. Yeah, me too. Anyway. Yeah. Silver Burn Gunner, this has been another one of the worst movies on Netflix. We'll see you next week. I swear I think Rob VD, or Rob VD, RVD <laughs> was like, in my contract, I want to make it so I could came more Jennifer Love You and Nerd Die. I try to protect him, but I go... Oh, and then I get to rub on her titty balls and then later on and movie finger her vagina while picking her up on boat.